So Twitch's animated emote feature has now been launched and you guys can upload your very own custom emotes. A few weeks ago, we actually showed you how you can animate your own static emotes to get some life into them. And now you'll be able to apply them on Twitch. How's it going, everyone? And welcome back to the Streamloops channel. And it is finally time where we can upload our Twitch emotes fully animated this is a really awesome thing and as i mentioned about two weeks ago we made a video talking about how you can animate your static emotes and get them rolling on in to actually become fully animated and professionally done if you want to actually take a look at the tutorial the link will be in the description and i'll show you how to do that but in today's video we're going to be showing you guys how to upload your emotes and get them working we're also going to be showing you guys Twitch's new platform that allows you to animate your emotes and again this one is very limited so i do recommend taking a look at our previous tutorial so you can learn how to give your emotes their own life so with that being said let's go ahead and jump on into this so simply put all you need to do is to go over to twitch and again you need to be a partner to do this this will eventually come to affiliates once you're over here you're going to the section that says viewer rewards from here you go over to emotes and if you scroll down you'll now see an awesome section that says animated emotes now yours will be completely blank just like this and all you need to do is to click on the plus button you click on the upload button and then you upload any animated emotes you have make sure that you follow all of the requirements for the emote for it to be fully uploaded it needs to be in a square gif it needs to be no bigger than one megabyte at least 112 by 112 in pixels and it cannot have more than 60 frames these are all things that we mentioned and spoke about in our tutorial so again i highly recommend that you take a look we actually animated this emote so you can take a look at it over there and once you've done that you just simply put a title and you upload your emote and you're good to go now if you're not actually able to use photoshop and to animate your own emotes there is a new feature called use an existing emote simply put you go ahead and upload any of your emotes that you have that are stagnant we'll use our scared emote for example and then in the bottom you go to choose animation from here there's a lot of different things and for a scared emote a shaking animation would be quite nice you then can go ahead and click on the shake and you'll get what twitch basically hand delivers to you now again you can make this look a lot more clean and professional by animating it yourself but if you're looking for something just to go really quickly this is the way to go and you can also experiment with these and use something that will fit the mood for example if we were to use a hype emote we can use the rave animation and this will change the color so it does look a lot more hype than it actually is which is pretty cool and there is a bunch of different animation tools that you can use but as i said i highly recommend taking a look at a tutorial so you can get some lovely emotes like the ones that are currently here but my friends that is pretty much going to wrap it up for today's video hopefully you guys can get onto twitch and upload your very own emotes fully animated it's really awesome i'm so happy that twitch incorporated this feature and eventually this will also be rolled out to affiliate so you guys can use it as well i hope you found this video very helpful and enjoying if you did make sure you leave a like down below if you have any questions or comments or concerns leave it down in the comments below and we'll be able to get to you but my friends that's gonna wrap it up and we'll see you guys next time